generic greetings and welcome back once again to the last starship today's beverages a very nice standard cup of tea the good old reliable cuppa so welcome back to the game and in the previous episode we did a lot of trading as per usual obviously we are making the stargate program and we got our first gunboat the sp gunboat or new ship as it was originally called is fairly effective at taking out well it said fighters but it was it was technically a ship that we took out and a pirate four cannons on the front hopefully going to five um I'm going to see how many we can actually fit in. And obviously we've got like our Gatling guns and things like that. What I want to do is I want to tell these guys to basically stop gathering stuff because I need the drones and we'll recover all of these. Because what we're going to do is basically we're going to set this thing. It does have, uh, does it have a hyperdrive? It does not have a hyperdrive. Ah, that's a bit, a bit of a spanner in the work. So with the gunboat, we managed to take some stuff out, but we weren't able to like gather anything because well we didn't have that ability however if we were to get an ftl drive and some ftl charges i don't think we need a huge amount probably just six will do we'll put an ftl drive on this thing and we'll be able to jump to where we've just left and then hopefully gather some stuff up probably more drone bays are in order but we shall see so yeah let's also have a look over here again trading and selling and there's some more stargate frames which will confirm and i think also some copper ingots that we're producing yeah it'd be nice if we get some scrap it would be very nice indeed over to uh, defense and there is another cannon available so we will pick that up I do really want a weapons control center, but I don't know if it's actually possible. Anyway, over to installation and the FDL drive, which can go at the back there. Naturally, we have to pipe that up. Uh, actually, no, sorry, cable that up like so. And if I was to go to sector map, uh, over to NG15, where there's a derelict, maybe we can, yeah, maybe we can, you know, align that and see what happens. Install cannon there short robot arm there <laughs> and storage cannon shells there we go cables I'm going to remove all of these cables because it's just a bit yeah a bit problematic the way it looked originally okay that's now in and hopefully Better. We can see it is off to one side, but not that you can really tell, and I'm not too bothered. So the scavenger, I am going to send out on its own, which is maybe a big mistake, but, well, we'll see. We still have to take out the hostile forces in, was it NG9, which isn't going to happen. So over to here, and this is where we can see all of the all of the uh yeah bits of scrap and there's lots of stuff we've got among other things it's got a tactical you can't really see from that mode but we've got oxygen bottles we've got all of this i don't know how we can collect it all but there's also some fuel some ammo there's scrap that's what we're after we're after scrap okay Got a big set of storage there. Oh, we've picked up... Oh, I was going to say we picked up Gatling guns. We haven't picked up Gatling guns. We've um, disassembled them from here and here, which, to be fair, is... I'm totally fine with. I'm thinking of um, just putting in some more drone bays. So how are the drones doing? They're just cracking on with over... Oh, there, there, there. Let's just uh, drive into the middle of all of this. Spin this round. And we'll let them crack on. You've got the derelict ship here. Lots of stuff. Oh, what's that? Not too sure, but either way, I'm going to fill the cargo. I'm very tempted to expand the scavenger here, because it's, it's, it's now pulling double duty as a gatherer. So, yeah, we shall see. I mean, we, we could just make a tanker of some kind. Speaking of tanker, we're actually running low on Metron gas, of all things. We are trying to make Stargate resin. It's still working, which is good. And... We are making Tilium Crystals, which then makes the FTL Charges, which we don't really need to keep a lot on this thing. And it's a quick way to make money. Excellent. Over to the mining station. And yeah, I do think that 
destroying ships is I do think that's the way forward to to allow us to produce more stuff here. One Stargate frame only. <laughs> uh, we also have scientists. That was research though, isn't it? Energy transmission. Mm. I mean, it might be... Might be the way forward. But it's also ridiculously expensive. But, just being able to get some. We need a science station, we need a supercomputer, and we need a scientist. A lot of money. A lot of money. How's the scavenger doing? Oh, it's scavenging quite well. <laughs> it's a very apt name for it. What have we got? I'm noticing some cannon shells, scrap metal. Yeah, to be honest, the scrap metal is what we're after. It's a shame we have to... We see these other things floating around, bodies and such. Wonder where else we can go. Um, ah, over here. Yeah. So we'll we'll scavenge this. Then we'll head back over the other one. All right. Uh, trading and energy. There's now some more solar panels available, which I will purchase. Naturally, we'll have to add in some scaffold. Confirm that. Where possible, I want this thing always powered by... Always powered by the uh, solar. It doesn't move around. Actually, while I'm trading as well, I'm just going to pause it. And... I want to put in another airlock. Or another docking port, should I say. So I install... Docking port. I just want to make sure we've always got options for docking. There's all that. Cables. Run across. Ah, right. Yeah, scaffold goes across like that, I think. Didn't he go one further? He needed to go one further. <laughs> Not a problem. Confirm. And I'm actually going to make it stick out the front. Just so I gives me a bit of a reminder. So, cables are now in. Which is hopefully making everything work fine. How are we doing over here? Oh, everything is sort of getting collected. Let's have a look back at the scavenger. And we can see the sort of things we're getting. Oh, the drones are trying to keep up. <laughs> We've got lots of scrap metal, some bullets and such, Gatling guns, which I'll probably end up selling. Although it's probably not a bad thing to have. There's another ship here. The Swordfish. Looks pretty good. Lots of reactors. So where's our drones? There they are. They're coming along. And again, lots of stuff to pick up. Just to see what that is. What is that? What is that indeed? So, for this thing, I'm going to sell that resin once again. Whatever the next, <laughs> the next goal is for um, <laughs> yeah, whatever the next goal is for uh, the. Stargate. I'm going to guess we've already done the resin part of it. <laughs> um, Tillium crystals and hyperspace isotopes. Are we out of hyperspace isotopes? Yes, we are. Ah. So, do we want a bit of a travel, maybe, with this thing? It's possible. I think what I want to do, though, we've got a contract. Oh, pirate gangs. Neutralise Pirate gang. It's System 8. Let's have a look at System 8 first. It is... There. Which is a colony. Alright. I think that would be rude not to. Sign of the gunboat. Good. Um, FDL. Prepare the jump. 
over to the scavenger, which is, we're going to say Stargate program, and I want to prepare the jump on that one, which we can stop, yep, that's fine, just waiting for everything to unload now, let's go back up to the gunboat, and jump. Oh! What is this? Courier mission? Ah. Um. Someone may have picked up the wrong mission. <coughs> Delivery. Okay. Um. <laughs> I thought I picked up the... Which one have I picked up? Curry mission. Deliver. Okay, I'm just gonna have to go. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to go back and forward. Hmm. Supplied 17 out of 50. Fine. <laughs> Alright. It's easy enough to do. It's just gonna require a little bit of back and forward. How's the scavenger doing? I think. Have they, there's lots of stuff they haven't picked up. Is it because of the FTL? Yeah, right. We now know. Signing the FTL like that uh, brings the drones in, which makes perfect sense, to be fair. There's the gunboat. Bringing stuff over. Uh, naturally, we want to go back to the Stargate. <laughs> Prepare the jump. Okay. Well, it's not the job I anticipated doing with a gunboat, but hey, we can actually complete it with a gunboat. And I'm guesstimating when we jump back, it will then say, oh yeah, no problem, here's all of the, uh, here's the stuff. Eh? Contract completed. I am not going to argue about that. <laughs> Neutralized pirate gang. Difficult rating of four. I don't know. I mean, can we do it? We require a combat rating of at least two. So this thing. Toughness is 983. Right? Is that good? <laughs> is, that a, is that a good combat rating? I don't know. But I'm going to attempt it. So repair all damage. So affected a repair there. Scavenging is still underway here. See all of the bits. Oxygen loaders. And what's this thing coming in? That red thing. It's explosives. Hmm. Yes, please store those next to the thing that doesn't explode. Right, let's try this contract. Neutralize pirate gang. System of uh, star system three, which is there. Let's prepare the jump, and definitely is it definitely neutralize pirate gang. Accept for the combat vessel. Jump. And should have activated guns first, but it's not a too much of a problem. I'll just pause it immediately as we jump in. Battle stations. Tactical. There's the two enemy ships. What have they got? Two small vessels. Hostile fast mover and a runabout light corvette, which is exceptionally quick. And why are we just not moving? Okay. This is not going as planned. Oh, there's also a miner over there. Right, the fast mover is getting shot by our PDCs. We do have armor, which I think is something they don't have. But they are keeping, sadly, the front away from us. They're, they're much quicker than we are. But if I can just track their light corvette, I think we are gaining on it now. Here we go. Cannon shells out. 
Miss, 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 and that's uh, that's all, all the misses. <laughs> but if we get a couple of hits, there's a good hit. Keep tracking. There we go. That's what we want to see. We've taken 9% damage. They've taken 44% and 7% respectively. And obviously every time we... Oh yeah. They're taking considerable damage now. I'm going to try. I'm trying to get behind them. I'm not too worried about the PDCs, quite frankly. 30% damage though, and they're gone. Okay. What damage have we got? Uh, hang on. What damage have we got? A fair bit, but we're still fighting. We're still in the fight. Turn this way. Turn the other way. Yeah, the fast mover is... Yep, yeah, for its namesake. But, we have front towards enemy. No, we didn't fire! It's not actually turning as well. Activate throttle and turn. There we go. PDCs were firing for a second. And lock on. Lock on. Fire. No. Didn't fire again. But we are behind it now. I have a feeling that this volley should do it. Oh. We are firing now. Reducing throttle a bit. Good couple of hits there. There's some more. It's on 55% damage. Come on. 65. Get behind it again. Surprised we um able to not weather the damage, because you know we are in the first place, but that's 100 percent damaged. Another couple of shots and it's gone. There it is. Well, that was. CO2 warning on the gunboat, is it? I think so. I think so. Alright, well. Battle stations don't need. Sector map. We're currently in number three. We're going to go back to Stargate. So, FTL. Prepare the jump. Over to the scavenger, which by the look of it is all fine. FTL. Prepare the jump. And then jump home. So we do have this CO2 warning, 11% fatal. So we need, a, we need a CO2 scrubber on that. Or, to be fair, if we were to do some research, we do have energy transmitter bl blueprint, fluid logistics. I see those are unlocked. I, I thought they were unlocked. Mm. Anyway, let's... um. Let's see what we can do. So, gunboat. Yeah, we've got that set. Jump. We'll bring this back first because I want to repair it. And then obviously we'll have a look at this. Uh, we'll look at this CO2. So, repair all damage. 27,000. For the scavenger, we want to... Find our... It's, it's this thing here. Okay, we want to start shipping some stuff off. So I'll connect it first. Oh, we're going to have to spin around. And dock up. Like so. So just do some manual overriding here. Oh, there we go. And we're connected. So. And the scavenger's got CO2 warning as well. Basically, we're going to have to look at all of that, aren't we? But we can do that in a moment. So, trading, selling. What do we want to sell? Well, there's a lot of this stuff we're just not needing. Oh, a sign station, though. Definitely com keeping that. Um, energy cells. FGL charges. Bullets. We'll get rid of those. Cannon shells. We've got food, which will keep refined metrion, hyperspace isotopes, stable isotopes. We'll s not sell the spacesuits. And that should be, I believe that. 
completed. Oh, we'll do that. That's a good profit. But now we're going to go for the logistics. So it's from the scavenger and to the GMC mining station. We want to send over munitions bench, science station, and only five scrap metal, sadly. Hmm. There ain't much there. Oh, copper. And that should be it. Good, right. While they're transferring that over, over to the gunboat and trading. Habitation. Small tank. CO2 scrubber. Air duct. Confirm. In the editor, I'm going to increase the size of the hull. Like so. And increase the floor plan, like so. Because we do need to sort that out. So, installation. Another small tank. CO2 scrubber. Um, oh, hang on. Have I done this wrong? Air duct. Mm. Yes, done this wrong. It is the CO2 scrubber, which we have. Yeah. Which goes into the tank. And then we need the cleaner. Trading. Airy processor. That's it. And then we'll sell. We don't want to. We don't want to keep the air duct again, and probably the loader. Confirm. All right. Good. Cables. Run that across. Pipes. It's going to go to there, to there, and then over to the next one, whatever that happens to be. The ship's coming in now. There we go. And the airy processor can not fit in there. Oh, okay. We'll have to place it out of the way. So it's not all going to fit in there, is it not? Curious. Can I place it here? I can. <laughs> it's not very good. I'll see what I can do. Oh, there's no way, is that? That's not happening. I think what we'll do is we'll dismantle these two then reinstall them I and mean, put that out of the way shame the oxygen loader can't go there and pipe work so it's going to be a bit of a Bit of a weird one, but it, it will work. CO2. And oxygen. That should now work. So we scrub the CO2, goes into the small tank, and then eventually gets processed. Good. Scavenger. Similar thing. So, trading. Hmm, weapons Control Center. I need to transfer that over to the other ship, don't I? Anyway, we're going to go for habitation. Small tank, CO2 scrubber. Oh! There's no processor here. We're going to have to send this elsewhere. All right, fine, fine. We have got a repaired gunboat. How are we doing for cannon shells? We're running out of cannon shells. How curious. So, defense. Cannon shells. Let's just, let's just max out. And I definitely want a weapons officer at some point. GMC mining station. Anything to sell? Anything we can buy? 
guessing. I definitely want a science station. Oh no, we've got a science station, haven't we? Install science station. I'm going to place a science station maybe there. And all we need then is a supercomputer and a scientist. And I'm assuming as well that you want a space suit with that. But we don't have... Uh, I'm going to sell the munitions bench. But we do have the ability to do that. Right, let's get science going then. Let's see if we can do all of this. How's the scavenger doing? It's uh, it's all right. Tactical. We'll undock that. And let's head over to the shipyard. I just want to go to somewhere else because it will have, hopefully, then... I want to... Uh... Trade ord 97,000. I want to, uh, yeah, head over and see if I can buy the, the uh, oxygen scrubber. Trade ord. Oh, yeah, we're waiting for the rest of it to go. It's because we were docked up. Right, that's fine. So, science station is in. Supercomputer also goes in. Cables, which is the, sort of the first time we've ran these. We'll bring them in like that. Oops, connects up. I don't know which power this requires. But I'm guessing it's quite a lot. How are we doing for this? Uh, they're still trading. Yeah, they've got all sorts of stuff to move over, the crew. Do you want more crew here? I think we could probably afford more crew. Let's confirm that. And you can see the crew <laughs> just randomly appear from the shuttle. <laughs> it's fine. A couple more spacesuit things would probably be worth it. And there's a supercomputer and the science station. So... Let's begin research on metallurgy level 1, which is smelter efficiency 20%. So the scientist comes along, and there we go. They're doing signs. I can tell that because there's now loads of flashing lights. Sadly, the supercomputer is uh, <laughs> not really doing anything. And they seem to be very surprised the type of science they're seeing. <laughs> but it is researching. And we're on 3%. Oh, it shows you what you need. So you need a supercomputer. No, sorry, you need a research station, but not a supercomputer. Whereas some of these other ones will probably require supercomputers. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. How are we doing for the scavenger? We're still waiting for them to trade the rest of it. Are there... Not able to trade the rest over. Trade ord, 56,000. I mean, what? What is it? I'm not sure. We're also a bit low on food, actually. I'm not going to concern myself with it, because I, I just needed to just... It says also drones deployed one, but shouldn't have any. Because we're not on gather materials or gather salvage. Is it storage? It's like the drone bay is stuck there. Any cargo? Just put that there. No, they don't need to move stuff across. So I'm not, I'm not too sure what's happened there. But the dro drone's stuck. And also, there's like cannon shells and railgun slugs. That's not in here. In this list for sale. Is it because of the FTL? I've aborted it. Hmm. I am not too sure what's going on there. Tell the move. 
There's obviously something that I'm missing. <laughs> hmm. Prepare. Yeah, it still says about the deployed uh, drones. Okay. I'm not sure on that one. Well, I do know that it's going to be fatal if we don't get the stuff traded over. So, a bit of a shorter episode, but we're going to leave it there for now. That's been a bit of the last starship. We have a lot of new contracts, neutralised pirate gangs, which we only just managed to succeed on the last one. I'm not really too sure about... Uh, yeah, I'm not really too sure. I would fare off something a bit bigger. The issue that I have is just resources and getting them. And it's starting to get to a point where we can, there's not much we can really do. And there's nothing obvious springs to mind. We can buy some scrap and metal ingots, metallic minerals. We can buy a lot of this now, which is all useful. So we'll buy that in. That'll increase this. But I'll have a think, because, well, five episodes in now, and yes, we've done the Stargate resin, yes, we've done all the copper ingots, Stargate frames, we're only just over half, and that's phase, that's phase two of six? Hmm. I'll have a think. We might leave it there, we might continue on. Let me know in the comments, and... We'll see how we get on, whether we leave it or save it, come back later on, decide to build the more Stargates. I don't know. I haven't decided. We have, however, ticked off combat, salvaging, building, automation. The only thing we haven't really done is some of, say, the like hydroponics and building munitions. But other than that, we have seen a lot of what is on offer. Let me know what you think. And as always, hope you have enjoyed it. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic partings.